Hi, this is Travis with Wakanda Boats. We're here in Republican City, Nebraska. We're also in Glen Elder, Kansas. And today we get to show you the new, this is the new 2019. This is the one 220 LFC. Um, this is our most popular tri-tune model. Uh, the, the LFC basically stands for cruising fish. We like to call it a skiing fish. Uh, the reason it is so popular is because it is very versatile. It's, it's uh, very fisher friendly yet has plenty of, of lounge seating and storage in it for when you just want to do recreational things. Um, also, it's kind of that perfect size. The 220 is a little bit mislabeled in the fact that this is actually a 23 foot uh, boat. And uh, just a brief history with this is Lund's third year uh, running, uh, having their pontoon line. Uh, how this came about, uh, Lund basically uh, got merged with, uh, with uh, Harris float boat, Harris Chaos. Um, so they are actually build the, the chassis for Lund, um, the, and if anybody knows anything about Harris, they've been building pontoons, they specialize in pontoons, they've been building them forever, they're a very high-end, very high-quality, high-spoken-for uh, pontoon line. And it was really a perfect marriage because Lund integrates their fishing, uh, fishability to uh, what is a great pontoon chassis, and we have a great marriage with this. The reason it's so popular is because it's very high-end, very well built, very functional, uh, yet very, very affordable. These are very, very uh, competitively priced to a lot of our other, you know, tritunes we've sold in the past, some of what we consider high-end tritunes. This has all of those features and very, very affordable. Um, so let's look back. We're going to talk a little bit about the construction here first, because really what sets apart a good pontoon tritune to what we consider entry level is when you want to compare is from the deck down. Uh, if you look at how well these are built, these are all machine welds. That's one of the first things you want to look at when you can compare uh, pontoons. Machine welds, very, very durable, very well. Everything is nice and clean. Um, again, they, they specialize in, in pontoons, so this is something that's been built up over the years. Now, because this is the third year that these have been out, I can also tell people honestly that this pontoon or this tritune configuration is five mile an hour faster than any other tritune that we've sold in the past. We've sold a lot of different brands uh, in the tritune, and with horsepower and size being equal, this, this chassis is five mile an hour faster. Um, so if you look at it, we, we do what they call the Performance Plus package. So what that means is you're going to get the full length tritune. It's the full length, it's not the three quarter tube, it's the full length which is important for performance. The other thing that Performance package gives you, they have lifting strakes on all three tubes. So your center tube is going to have lifting strakes on each side and then your, your interior, your outside tubes are going to have also the lifting strake toward the interior. I think this has a lot to do with why we're getting so much performance or so much speed out of it is just the design of, of how, they, how they do this. Now if you look in the back, this, this model that we're looking at with this video has the 150 horse. Um, we're getting a lot more calls for guys requesting the 200 horse, so we stock, we, we have a lot of 200s ordered. Uh, we stock both. We have the 150 and the 200 both uh, will be in stock. Um, again, back to that Performance Plus package, we talked about the Tritune, the lifting strakes, it has a larger uh, or it has a max horsepower rating is, is, is higher set because of the beefed up transom that they put on it and then it also has a larger fuel tank for guys that are going to go on big water. Uh, another upgrade that we put on it is the stainless steel ski tow bar. That's something we're going to put on all of these models. This, this gives you the ability to pull tubes, skiers, wake borders, whatever you wish. Uh, another thing that we order with these, if you look down here on the engine, this is that inertia, mercury inertia prop. Now this is an expensive prop, but it's well worth the expense because of the performance gain you get. This, this prop was designed by Mercury specifically for Tritunes, and so we put that on all of the Lund uh, Tritunes that we stock. It's going to come with that engine. So again, you will have your option whether you want a 150 or a 200. Uh, we stock a lot of both. Um, if we pan out toward the outside, uh, they have a lot of really nice looking colors. The color you're looking at here is called technically called black bronze. So this means the, the majority of the accent is black and then you have the bronze uh, two-tone. Now another popular color would be this in reverse which they would call bronze black. So you have main color being bronze, accent being black. And then another popular color would be uh, the blue silver. We do stock several of those as well. This one's probably the most requested color so we probably stock more of this style than anything. 
Um, staying back here at rear also, we're all, it's going to come with a Yacht Club tandem axle trailer with brakes. We try and put good trailers under these for the customers that do want to take road trips and go to different lakes. Uh, it's, got a, it's got a good trailer, loads really well. Uh, it's got the bigger size wheels, so if you're on the interstate, you can certainly do that. Okay. We'll move up here toward the front and we'll go over the interior. Um, moving up here. Now the first thing we want you to notice is another upgrade that we put on these is what they call the tan fold teak. Okay, there's different options as far as what um, flooring you can put on these, whether it be carpet, whether it be, uh, there's different grades of, of vinyl. We always do the highest end vinyl you can get, which is what this is. This is called the tan teak, full vinyl. And the advantage with this is there's really no reason to put carpet in a pontoon anymore because there's so much carpet in a pontoon, it's really hard to keep clean. This vinyl takes care of that because you can just hose it down to keep it clean. And then this new vinyl also is, is much more durable than what it used to be. Uh, it's not slick when it's wet and it's not hot on bare feet. Those were all the disadvantages to the what we call the old school vinyl. This is the new vinyl that really there's no there's no cons to it, it's all pros. It's, it's definitely worth the expense of, of upgrading to this, so anything we have in stock, you'll see we'll have this tan teak. Now, if you've noticed the color on the interior, the color of the interior will be based on what exterior color you choose. So any time you do bronze, black, black, bronze, you're gonna have the tan interior, which I, I think really looks nice. It sets it off together. Now, for the folks that choose the blue silver, the interior is going to be gray and silver, including the, it'd be the gray vinyl versus the tan. Okay, now since we're here, um, well, let's, let's look at the floor plan. This is kind of what makes this so popular. You can see we have the wraparound lounge seating in the, in the bow. Now everywhere where you see seats, there's storage. So all these seats lift up. We have a removable cup holder here, but these will lift up and there's storage underneath all of these sofas all the way around. So you're, you're, you're not giving up storage uh, on this model, but yet you still have your fishability. Okay, and we're still here to the, I want to talk about one other upgrade we always stock because we do tri-tunes on everything. We're always going to add this, this called the in-floor ski locker. And this thing is huge guys. It starts here and it runs all the way almost two-thirds to the rear. So you can stack all kinds of gear in here. You can get rods in here. Um, you know, skis, wakeboards, whatever a guy wants to put in here. This is a big advantage with the Tritune is adding this extra storage here. They did add this uh, hydraulic arm on here this year as well, so it'll keep this door open if you want to uh, have it open, putting gear in there or trying to dry it out. Now, too, there is a uh, there is a bilge pump built into this too, so if you would happen to get water in here, rain, whatever it may be, you just hit a switch and the bilge pump will pump that out. Okay. Now there's also a big storage compartment here under the console. Uh, good for storage, stays, stays pretty dry in there. We have an LED light come up here toward the console. Really nice ergonomic dash here. Uh, we always stock ours with the Hummingbird uh, GPS fish finder that's installed in the factory so it's, it's in dash mounted for you. And then there's all kinds of uh, amenities on the console as far as you got a really nice kicker stereo. We try and add the four speakers with that, with most of the ones we have in stock, and then all of your instruments are right there readily available. Um, so again, it's uh, user-friendly, looks really nice. Got that wood grain look to it. This is the high back captain's chair here. This is the helm seat. This does recline, very, very comfortable. You have your armrests here, okay? And then move to the back. This is our fish station here to the rear. This is what makes it very versatile because you can see all the lounge seating you get to the front and then you have your fish station in the back, so guys that like to troll, um, we add what they call a convenience package. Uh, so you can see these seats are upgraded. These are the ProRide seats. This would be the same seat that you get in a high-end one, like a Tai, a Pro V, a crossover. That's a ProRide seat. We upgrade those. A convenience package gives you uh, rod holders. So you have a rod holder next to each seat. If you want to troll, you can. And then another cool thing about that, we have this. Uh, you're going to get two of these. You can add two more if you want, but these are those bumper buoy kits. And it's just got a button here that just snaps in. So it's super handy. Just snaps on. You don't have to tie knots. And then you got your docking buoys right there. Very accessible. Okay. Um, before I forget, too, we do add the rod box as well. This is lockable. So you can open this up and you've got four, you can get four rods in here and lock those up. 
That's another option that we try and put on all of them. And then if you look at your live well, this is another thing that kind of sets this apart. Um, by pontoon live well standards, this is very big. Okay, so we've got really good sized live well here. You can uh, put a bait tank here if you're going to use live bait. You can get minnows in there. Um, this is kind of a fish cleaning station here. It's got a built-in uh, ruler here for you. And then we also have tackle storage that opens up here on both sides that is lockable. So you can get your jigs and things locked up. Another really handy thing, your live well pump switch is right here back here so you don't have to go to the driver's seat to control your live well switch. And then that we also put the wash down station on these. So this is really cool because let's say you're on the beach or you know you have kids um, with muddy or sandy feet, you kick this pump on, you can spray their feet off before they get into the boat. So, um, One other thing we should mention, again, this is the stainless steel boarding ladder upgrade that we do. And then uh, the engine also has hydraulic steering. That's another part of that performance package. So it's a very smooth steering system. Um, another great thing that people like about this model, it actually has four points of entry. So you can see we have, a, we have a gate on both corners here to the aft. So you've got a gate here by the ladder, another gate here. And then if you look up here, there's an entry gate here to the side, and then of course one to the bow. So no matter what style dock you're on, you can, you can board very easily on this. So. Um, also, of course, it's going to come with the storage cover, which we have right here. This cover is kind of similar to their, their uh, aluminum wand covers in the fact that it has clips instead of snaps. So that cover is going to clip along a channel underneath here so you don't worry about those snaps coming apart. So uh, again, this is the one. This is the 220 LFC, the most popular floor plan uh, tri-tune. The only, I would say, disadvantage to these are they are limited edition, meaning we're, we're kind of limited to how many of these we can get. We always order as many as we can, but it doesn't always it doesn't always meet demand. So we do have a lot of these in stock and a lot of them coming for 2019. So if you have any questions, uh, give us a call or email us. Terry's in Glen Elder, Kansas, and I'm Travis here in Republican City, Nebraska. Uh, we'll have our email and phone number on the website and we'll put it in the description box for you as well. Thank you very much.